it's Tanya with Red Kernel Crafts and today I want to show you this kit that I was sent. This is really cool. It's a 5D diamond painting kit and the company sent this to me and I have a discount code and the link to their website down below in my description. If you use the discount code you receive 10% off and it's unlimited. You can use it multiple times so that's not a problem. I'll just show you their website here. Uh, they are in the UK and there are a ton of pictures. Whatever you are looking for they have. I'll show you the collections. You can go in here, there's dogs, trees, owls, waterfalls, whatever you are interested in, it exists. So let's do, let's find an owl. I know some of my viewers like owls. Let's click on the owl. Let's see here. <laughs> let's pick this guy. So you click on the thing and you can order your different size and you can get square drills or round drills and what that means are the little pieces so let me show you this kit and let's open it up and see what is inside so you receive your canvas and this one is 30 by 30 centimeters and the reason I wanted this because I looked online for Ikea and <laughs> I always buy my frames from Ikea and there's a frame that will fit this. So that's why I wanted um, a square one and I wanted it uh, this size. So you receive your canvas. On the side of the canvas, it's like a, it's like a fabric, sort of. And then down the side, it shows your color codes for all your drills. Now the drills are these. These are what you're going to basically paint with. And they're all color coded, so they match the codes on the side and it shows the number here uh, on the bag. So this is what I'm going to be painting with. And then you receive your drill pen, which has a nice little grip on it. And then you have this red wax and you peel this back and then you dip this into the wax and then you can pick up a drill with the end of this. So let me just show you that. Let me just get a few drills out of the bag here. So let's take this one here. Let's see what the first square calls for. So it's a white square up in the top corner and the white square is number 939. So let's look for the bag. You have a tray to put your drills into and then you can pour them back into your bag. So that's very handy. <laughs> I'm in an unfinished basement and you can hear every sound that goes on above my head. So you pour these into your thing. You take your drill pen, you peel back the plastic and you push this in and it puts a little bit of wax right in the tip of that pen and then you can shake these into the little grooves. There's little grooves in the pan. In the pan. You pick it up and then you place it onto the little square and then it's the square is sticky so don't peel this entire thing off. Just peel a little bit at a time so it stays sticky. And then you can do the entire thing. So any square that is white, I'm gonna put these on. This is the coolest thing. It's like paint by number. And I don't even have like um, magnifying my magnifying glass or anything on. This is so cool. Oh my God, my kids would love this. They include a set of tweezers. They also include, and it came in this really neat case, they include this pen and it has a wax tip on it. So you can, so when you shake these, they will land in the grooves flat side down. So that is brilliant. I don't know how that's doing that, but it does. And every kit you get, you will always get the, the tweezers and the pen and everything um, every time you order a kit. But this, this is gonna be really cool, I think. So now, I'm gonna put these back in the bag. And because of this handy little tray, they just go back in like that. Cool, all right, so now the next color I need is, it's a gray square with a little flower, so 823 is the color I need. I wouldn't give this to kids that are too little, but I mean, there's no reason why a, a kid couldn't do these kits. 
I just switched out to using this drill pen and it feels a little more accurate. Um, the tip on it is a little bit smaller than the other one, so I find I can get um, a better placement. Oh no, I just said that and I got a piece of wax. There we go. Um, yeah, it just feels like I can pinpoint exactly where the pieces are supposed to go. Um, and I'm thinking my daughters would really enjoy this. One more thing, I'm only pouring a few of the drills into the tray at a time because I don't want to expose too much of the piece because I don't want, you know, the air to get to it or, you know, dust in the air or anything um, to get to it and then take the stickiness away. So I'm just gonna do a few more of this color and then I'm gonna go back to um, this darker color and do those flowers and just kinda you know, slowly pull it away. So my daughter Kerrigan <laughs> He was 16, just came down to see what I was doing, and now she's kind of taken over. <laughs> but I got all this done so far today, so I'm pretty excited about it. Little update, guys. It is a little bit later in the day. I've lined up the little packages in like number order. So these are the 400s, 500s, 600s, and so on. And I've started working across this way. So I've got this section done and then all the way over here. So it's coming along really good. It's so cool. I'm enjoying this. So I'm gonna take a break for tonight, I think, and I'll be back to work on this tomorrow. Hey guys, it's day two of my diamond painting. I am enjoying this so much and we have snow right now. Today is September 30th, uh, but we've had snow. It's been snowing since Friday and it's still lightly snowing now. So it's Monday, September 30th. Like this is insane. So because it is snowy and yucky out right now, this is the perfect craft to work on. So here we go with day two. I think as you go throughout your career, you're gonna, um, you're probably gonna have different, you're gonna end up doing different things. Hey guys, just wanted to do an update on this kit, the diamond painting. It's coming along. I've been working for two hours. I did like all this area in here. Um, I wanted to get it lined up so that I'm straight along this part here. And I'm really enjoying it. All my drills sitting here. And uh, this, I'm about halfway, I'd say. And this is the only amount of wax I've used out of this thing. And I still have a whole other packet here. I'm still using this one. I reached for this pen at one point to use the wax tip and um, I still find this one uh, better. It's just more precise um, with the tip. And I've also used the tweezers because I've put one down in the wrong spot and I've been able to pick it up with the tweezers. So those are really handy as well. Hey guys, so I just wanted to come back with an update on my 5D diamond painting. I am halfway done, which is really cool. I've been, I started over here and I was kind of working all sort of going sideways and then I ended up bringing it all in a line. And now it's a lot easier because I just have to peel the paper back. I'll peel it back about an inch and I'll find a symbol. I'll fill in that color all the way along and then um, keep going with each color until I get that whole section filled but really enjoying this craft I'm gonna come back in another video when I do get it completed but what I wanted to do is just get this video up so you can see this and with Christmas coming it would make a really neat uh, present for someone it's like cross stitch without the pointy needles and having to thread them it's shiny I love the uh, square drills I'm sure the round ones are neat too but I love that the square ones totally fill up the space 
Um, but yeah, it's really fun. So check my link down below. There is a coupon code down there that you can use. And uh, the website is linked there as well. So check these out. It makes uh, a great gift for people, I think. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and seeing what this was like. And I just want to say a thank you to the company um, for sending me this. I'm really appreciative of that. And um, yeah, so go get your diamond painting kit and uh, have fun with it. I will be back with a video in the future and show you what it looks like when I do have it all done. But I want you guys to um, to at least see it and get out there uh, to do your Christmas shopping. <laughs> all right. So I hope you guys are good and I'll be back with some more videos soon. All right. Take care, guys. See ya.